So I needed a um, timing app or like a stopwatch app for personal usage, but I didn't want to um, build it myself. So I'm going to be employing two tools, GitHub Copilot and OpenAI ChatGPT to see which one can generate a better timing app. Let's start with the Copilot one. So I have Copilot installed on here and I'm just going to write a uh, boilerplate. Then I'm going to put a comment saying uh, stopwatch. Then let's see what we'll generate. Okay. Let's test it out. We have this. It's pretty good. Now let's add some styling to it. I'm just gonna do styling. Sometimes it doesn't oh there we go. Yeah, sometimes it takes a while. I mean, not the best styling I've seen. Uh, maybe let's try that again. I'm gonna open Copilot and do it this time. Okay, let's try this one. Oh, I like that way better. Okay, and let's end the script here. We're just basically just gonna let it run until it feels like it needs to stop. Yeah, let's test it out. So, you start it, and it doesn't seem to update. A little weird. There's no function to find run. Yeah, wow. Actually, a really yeah, it's it's wow. Surprisingly, what, what did it take? Like ten seconds, or, or like a minute, maybe at most. Let's see if we can get a better styling, because I I want a slightly better styling. Let's try this one. That's basically the same thing. I want more like material UI type of styling. So let's see if we can find something like that. Maybe this. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Looks pretty good. And then we can just add some something like this. Maybe increase the shadows a little bit. And yeah, we have a fully working style, um, stopwatch app. Just gonna rename this um, something else. So index, and that is Copilot. Okay, let's make another one. This time, let's get ChatGPT to do it. So, can you write a HTML stopwatch app in one file? Interestingly, this is rendering in PHP. Um, not ideal, but the code seems to be pretty fine. There's no like inherent error 
within any of this code so far, so that's looking pretty good. You know, what I like about this is that it, it writes, it defines uh, like future functions as well. Let me just take this and uh, see if it works. Okay, so it doesn't seem to continue whenever it starts again. So that's a bug. Um, can you write the script so it resumes when it stops? Hopefully it just writes, oh. Oh well. We're gonna be here a while. Um, yeah, let's let's not do that. Let's just say, can you add styling? Okay. Let's paste this in and see how it goes. Uh, so yeah, there there is styling. And does it start again? It does start again. How did how did they fix it? Oh, they just yeah. They made the start time. Um, so they made the start time just uh, like a global variable. So. That seems to work. Um, um, honestly, I'm not a huge fan of the styling. I'm just gonna say, like, can you make a updated styling uh, in both in a separate CSS file? <laughs> Let's see if the styling's better. And they just don't use a separate H. Oh, well, I guess it does. They, I mean, I, I really don't like how they re, like regenerate every single code. I don't, I don't think that's necessary. Um. I'm not gonna wait any longer to <laughs> wait out for that code, so we're just gonna stop it here. All right, so here are the two apps side by side. The left one is generated by Copilot, and the right one's generated by ChatGPT. Let's see. So they both work as normal. If you're using any of these, I mean, there there's not really much of a difference, except maybe in UI. I do like. So I, I, I say in terms of usability, I will probably use the Copilot one more, mostly because it looks better. Uh, but the ChatGPT is also not that bad. I, I prefer the disabled buttons too. That's a really nice touch. I mean, overall, they both did their jobs pretty great. So I'm not complaining. Overall, I think that uh, Codepilot is much better at generating code, mostly because it was trained on generating code, while uh, ChatGPT is more generalized in usage. If you enjoyed the video, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment below to see what you think, and follow for more episodes.